Good day, everyone. Today we will talk about polygons. What do you know about polygons? The word polygon comes from Greek. The term poly means many, and gon means angle, which is also related to the side. In a simple definition, we can say that a polygon is a closed two-dimensional figure with straight sides. Study each figure below and tell whether or not it is a polygon. Figure 1 is definitely a polygon because it is a closed figure with sides that are made up of straight lines. Figure 2 is not a polygon because the edges are curved. The third one is also not a polygon because this figure has an opening. So this is not a closed figure. There are different types of polygons. The polygons may be classified as regular or irregular polygons. What have you noticed with the regular polygons? All the sides and the angles are equal. It means the length of the sides is the same and the size of each angle is also the same. While irregular polygons may have different lengths of sides and different sizes of angles as well. In other words, the sides and the angles are different. Polygons may also be classified as convex or concave. Study this example of a convex polygon below. What can you say about the interior angles? A convex polygon has no angles pointing inward. It means all the angles are pointing outward. And also, no interior angle can be more than 180 degrees. However, in the case of a concave polygon, at least one interior angle is greater than 180 degrees, and the same angle is also pointing inward. Polygons may also be classified as simple or complex. From the given examples, what can you say about a simple polygon? It is clear that a simple polygon has only one boundary, or just a single space. We can also say that a simple polygon is a polygon that does not intersect itself. On the contrary, a complex polygon intersects itself and this creates more than one boundary. There are several types of polygons which are usually named according to the number of angles and sides. It is done by combining a prefix which is a number derived from a Greek word and the suffix gon. Since a polygon is a closed figure, the least number of sides that a polygon can have is 3. Just like this one. The given figure has three sides and three angles, commonly known as a triangle. And a triangle is also called a trigon. A figure with four sides and four angles is called a tetragon, commonly known as a quadrilateral. A pentagon is a polygon with five sides and five angles, while a hexagon has six sides and six angles. A seven-sided polygon is called a heptagon. A heptagon has seven angles. An octagon has eight sides and eight angles. We call a nine-sided polygon an enneagon, widely known as a nonagon. A nonagon has nine angles. Deca means ten. Hence, a closed figure with ten sides and ten angles is called a decagon. A closed figure with 11 sides and 11 angles is commonly known as a hendecagon, also called an decagon or endecagon. And if the figure has 12 sides and 12 angles, it is called a dodecagon. A polygon with 13 sides and 13 angles is commonly known as a tridecagon, also called a triskydecagon. A closed figure with 14 sides and 14 angles is called a tetrachidecagon or a tetradecagon. A polygon with 15 sides and 15 angles is called a pentadecagon, while a polygon with 16 sides and 16 angles is called a hexadecagon. If a polygon has 17 sides and 17 angles, it is called a hep. Tadecagon. 
and an 18-sided polygon is known as an octadecagon. An octadecagon has 18 angles. A polygon with 19 sides and 19 angles is called a nonadecagon, also known as an enyadecagon. And a polygon with 20 sides is called an icosagon. There are lots of other types of polygons, but for this video, we will cover only up to 20. This time, let's try to answer the guide questions about polygons. The answer will be revealed to you right after each question. So here's the first one. What do you call a two-dimensional figure with many sides and angles? Is it a cube, a sphere, a cuboid, or a polygon? Have you made a choice? The obvious answer is a polygon. Here is another question. Which of these is not true about a polygon? Here are your choices. A polygon is a two-dimensional figure. A polygon has many sides. A polygon has many angles. And a polygon has curved edges. Which of these statements is not true? Let's go over each sentence. The first one is true. The second is also true. The same with the third. But the fourth one is not true because a polygon must have straight sides. Let's move on to the next question. This is an easy one. Which figure is not a polygon? A circle, a triangle, a rectangle, or a pentagon? Well, the obvious answer is a circle. A circle has no sides and no angles. Here is another easy question. What does the prefix poly mean? Does it mean one, a few, many, or two? I'm sure you got this one. Poly means many. For our final question, what type of polygon does the picture show? Is it a hexagon, an octagon, a pentagon, or a heptagon? Well, looking at the figure, it has five sides and five angles. Therefore, this is a pentagon. So, were you able to answer all questions correctly? I have no doubt you did great. If you find videos like this useful, a like would be appreciated. PDF copies of the lessons on this channel are available on our Facebook page. Should you need a soft copy of this lesson, you can always send me a message. This would be all for now. Stay safe, everyone, and have fun learning.